All right, everyone, let's go. Prongs Tom, welcome back. And now we wait for Prongs, as you do. All right, depth chart. All right, Barry James with a good prog. Reginald will be a good backup for us. Uh, Henderson actually with a good prog. Curtis will return as his backup. Phil Davis will be in there as well. Wide receiver wise, we're going to go through Bagley, but I feel like everyone already knew that. Tight end is where we have a strength here with Ross and Gaskin, both good. I actually didn't expect Gaskin to prog up. I'm in strength by Joe Thomas, but we're okay at a line, but we're not great. We're not deep at all. Uh, defensive line, we're okay as well. Uh, linebacker. I guess we'll roll with, I guess Hubbard's a little bit better. Honestly, no. All right. Corner, we're, ah, Junior, no. We still got Dent, though. I think our defense will be fine. We have by far the, I mean, this is the best quarterbacking situation I think we've ever had. I don't know. I say that, but we had Tyler Adams, but Tyler was made by our DL, or our OL. So, we'll see. Curtis, of course. Now let, let me take a look um, at our finances here. Um, I'm going to bring scouting down to like zero. Um, facilities can stay the same. I'm going to raise this to 44, which I think will be number 10. Actually, I'm going to raise to 47. I think I'm going to bring ticket prices to 111. Um, and facilities will bring up to 35. Yeah. Health? No, not worth spending. Alright. That, let's get to it. Alright, Barry, make us proud. wasn't as good a start as I was hoping. Uh, it doesn't help that Henderson got hurt. Um, that definitely did not help. We'll see if game two we can bounce back. Grant, no Henderson. Actually, a great game from Nick Curtis. He looks spry, but Barry James has actually really struggled. That, that was a better game for him. Henderson... Not really having as big effect as I hope. And we just lost Joe Ross to a big injury. Um, that's the end of this season, maybe next season. That's huge. That's unfortunate. I guess this happens with low finances, but fortunately we are Gaskin. Um, in this case, we lost uh, James, leading to Reginald playing. Um... Still hasn't thrown a career touchdown. He's like Nathan Peterman here. Yeah, uh, finally threw a touchdown, but just not enough. Uh, Henderson's honestly pretty struggling so far. He, he's at risk of Curtis potentially passing him on the depth chart, um, which I, I don't really want. But come on, Henderson, get your get your act together, man. Barry getting hurt again. But he has shown a lot more promise. We're definitely improved. Um, continuing to this adequately, I guess. Um, Henderson's really starting to show signs of struggle here. He, he's not too far from potentially being benched. Um, wide receiver-wise, we're not getting any great production. Just okay. Our O-line is ravaged by injuries. Damn. I guess as we get healthy throughout the season, we'll be we'll be doing a little bit better. So maybe Henderson will turn around. Now that we're at the trade deadline, if Henderson really can't turn around, I guess he might get benched. We're gonna have to watch him closely because if he shows signs of continuing to go down the hill, unfortunately, this could be the end of Henderson. He's really in a game that we won. Um, Bagley was obviously the star. Um, 
but from a rushing standpoint, actually, he wasn't worse than... Yeah. He, he was better. He's just... He's looking slow. He did rush for a touchdown here. Twice, actually. Um... Yeah, he just put up one of his bigger games. I guess I guess he's putting in effort. He's doing a little bit better all of a sudden. That's good. We'll see if he can keep up the improvement. Especially now with Nick Curtis injured. He, it looks like he is. Granted, we got blown out, which is not good. But Barry James was his first real big game. Henderson's now really in stride. He's really turned it around. Um, Barry James, definitely a rookie of the year candidate. Let's see, are we out of playoff contention, or are we still in it? We're 8-7. and seven. Oh, we need to win this next game. All right, guys, that means live sim time. Oh, okay, we don't get to live sim. We might get eliminated in the... Nope, we didn't get eliminated. All right, let's go. We'll go to the fourth quarter here. So we're down two. But it looks like we have the ball. Barry has less than 100 yards through three quarters. Evan Henderson has been the majority of our offense with 16 carries, 71. Um, from a receiving standpoint, Bagley's been pretty bottled up despite six catches. Um, Haney hasn't done a ton. Um, Evan Henderson's gotten a few targets, but hasn't really turned it into much, just six yards. We'll see. Barry to Haney. Haney rushing. Barry passes to Haney. Why is Haney so involved? Incomplete to Gaskin's punt. I think they were in a drive. Nope, they punted. Nick Curtis with a 20 yard return. That's good. Wow! Lowry, 67 yards! Lowry, breaking it open for us. See, can they do anything? Darren Clark getting hurt. Damn. Um, we have the ball now. We've held them. This is a huge drive for us. Um, they got holding. Or did we get holding? Nope. We got holding us on us. And then a sack. Third and 34. Barry drops back. 13 yards to Bagley. That's a punt. So they definitely need to score here. They're rolling. They're in the red. They're on our eight or three. All right, they scored. We're now down. They got a two-point conversion, so we need a... Evan Henderson, one yard. One yard. Henderson, negative three. That's a punt. Damn. We need to hold. They punted. We do have the ball back. All right. Own nine-yard line, though. Nick Curtis having a big play we needed. What? He punted? Wait. They had to punt again. Damn. They had to punt again. Wow, we just got very lucky with the penalty here. 44 seconds left. We're driving, but we're on our own 41, uh, our own 43, 26 seconds left. Seven yards. We're on the 50 yard line. We need like 20 yards here. Negative three, not helping. Three seconds. This is the defining put. Illegal use of hands on Gaskin. Damn. That's unfortunate. I think we got eliminated there. Yep. Shoot. That's unfortunate. It's a good run, though. It's definitely a good run. Travis Anderson made the Hall of Fame. I kind of want to see how he did the rest of his career. And Jim Trump. Damn. Um, let's see. 30-year-old running back is what we're looking for. It's actually helping... OJ would retire before it became a horrid contract. Here is Travis Anderson. Spent most of his career with... Until I traded him. 
he'd rushed for a thousand yards until I came in. Um, and he actually was, had a pretty good career. Yeah, definitely Hall of Famer in my book. So, yeah, we need to get better quickly. I don't want to be, I, I'm happy with the quarterback I have now. Um, yeah, we'll draft two defensive ends, a linebacker, um, safety, O-line. All right. Now let's see what we can return here. Defensive lineman, bring him in for a bit. Colton Jansen will be, probably not be a big help this season, I suppose. Henderson definitely was better in the second half of the season, but he really struggled this last season. Um, I guess we'll see how he does this year. Um, I'm definitely bringing Nick Curtis back. I mean, he was a huge part of our team uh, for the last two seasons, playing on special teams and such. He's a long-term running back. All right. I think I'll let everyone else go here. If I'm being honest. I guess I'll bring back. All right. So I got 12 million to work with. I'm going to try to move some contracts around. Let's see. Reginald, you're on your out. You've done nothing great. Oh, a second round pick. Ooh, starting receiver and defensive lineman. Ooh, a quality offensive lineman. Wow. Um. Honestly, I think I'm just going to... That corner at the bottom is tempting. Oh, that safety. But I think I'm going to do a second round pick from a bad team. Because I doubt he'll even make a difference on that team. Frees up some cap room too. Junior Williams, you were awful last season. Um, Can I dump him for a couple late round picks? Pair him in white. I think I'll take wise and I'll pair the two of them with two mid round picks. Honestly, that's not bad. Just dumping contracts here. All right, I want to invest in my lines. Ooh, difference maker. That's what that, that's hype. All right, I could really use at least one quality corner. I think pick that up in a Vaughn. All right, and I want to keep people under two million to fill out the rest of my squad. Cameron Moore is a good pickup. We'll do more C, I guess. All right. We got a lot of... We're all set in the back now. See, QB-wise. Dillard, I guess. I mean, he can't really be worse than he was, and he was actually on pace to be a competent enough backup. Um, yeah, I'm okay with that. Let's see what there is for wide receivers. There's Taylor Miller. Looks like he's... Pretty solid gadget guy. Um, I could always use one of those. Um, let's take a look at O-line guys now. Alright. And uh, there we go, guys. I'll see you guys next episode.